Tonight concluded five games in the span of 15 days for Toronto FC across all competition. And even given that, the Reds were still able to pull off a 1-1 draw against the Seattle Sounders. Travel, fatigue, all played a factor in tonight and even more so than the injuries themselves. Greg Vanny and his coaching staff had to dig deep into their roster in order to field a starting 11. And as a result of that, we got to see some familiar faces back into the starting 11. One in particular, Mark Bloom. His last start was October 2014, and he was more than eager to get back into the lineup after a long road to recovery. It's um, been about 18 months since I got an MLS start, so just kind of looking back and through the injuries, through the, the hard work that I've kind of put in to have it all culminate into this 90-minute performance was, it was pretty special for me just to be back out there. It's, uh, he did a great job. You know, he's been out for a long time and to come in and, and play the role that he did. You know, obviously he's, he's a right footer, right back, and to come in and play left back, and not just a, a left back, as a, a wing back, you know. Uh, for, for not having consistent 90 minutes, it's a tough spot, spot to come in, you know. It's a lot of running uh, for us to do, and he came in, he did a great job, was composed on the ball, and, and showed the type of player that he is. So I thought he did great tonight. I thought Mark was excellent. Um, you know, it's not his left side's obviously not his natural side, though he's played a lot, a lot of it. Um, I thought he looked composed. I thought his his decisions when to leave um, the line to get out and press were um, decisive. Uh, I thought he defended well. I thought he had a had a great game. Um, so it's great to get him back in the mix um, because uh, you know it will help us between he and Beta competing for that right side. You know, right now we're also a little thin on the left side with Ash and. Um, with Ash and Danny out and Justin playing so many minutes. So uh, having Mark back in the mix and, and competing with the group is great. I'm, I'm happy for him because it's been a long grind for him to get back out there. And uh, he answered it uh, beautifully tonight. These next few days leading into Toronto FC's next matchup against the Chicago Fire will provide some much needed rest and recovery. For all of your other updates and interviews, make sure that you head over to torontofc.ca.